Oh hello Emily. Fancy seeing you in here today. In the break room? Mr. Edwards, I just saw you eating a roast beef sandwich from the fridge like 15 minutes ago. I don't recall. Speaking of which, my sandwich is missing. Mr. Edwards, I don't mean to accuse anyone of anything, but did you eat my roast beef sandwich? It was clearly marked, Emily's roast beef sandwich. Oh Emily. <laughs> One thing about managing a multi-thousand dollar company is that I can't be everywhere at once. Which is why I hire people like you. You know, to make sure fingers don't get caught in the paper shredder. Reading labels. Making copies. Disgusting sexual favors. And to help with performance reviews. I'm afraid your sandwich mishap is out of my hands. There's only so much I can do. You know, Emily. I've been keeping my eyes all over you. And I can see you've been doing a fantastic job. Thank you Mr. Edwards. So I'll tell you what. I'll have to take you out for dinner to make up for that bastard who stole your lunch. You must be starved. I'll pick you up around 8. Oh. Um. I'm actually making dinner for my family tonight. Mr. Edwards. I've been married for 12 years. Surely you're not asking me on a date. Emily. I'm sure you haven't read the company manual thoroughly. And if you did, then you've obviously forgotten where it clearly states. When Mr. Edwards asks an employee to dinner it's strictly business. And nothing more. Mr. Edwards. I wrote the company manual. Well then it's clearly amnesia. Or you're on drugs. You're not on drugs. Are you Emily? Of course not Mr. Edwards. Then surely you can call your family and let them know your superior would like to have a business orgy dinner. I suppose I can give my husband a call. Splendid. <coughs> There's a lovely restaurant on 5th and Van Ness. Okay. May I bring my family? Are they into anal? Excuse me? Ask Clay, Emily. Ask Clay. Mr. Edwards. I don't think this conversation is very appropriate. How dare you? So about that raise? I never asked for a raise. You know we have a zero tolerance policy when it comes to drugs, Emily. I am not on drugs. Well then how do you explain your erratic behavior Mrs. Crazy Pants? Crazy what? Pants, Emily. Pants. Mr. Edwards. How dare you. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'll pick you up a date. My husband's totally into anal. Splendid. 